In this video, I will guide you on how to farm gold lotus crowns in Dragon Nest Sea. In addition, I will give some important tips that you might not know yet. So, be sure to watch the whole video. For those who didn't know, gold lotus crowns is the main enhancement material you need to enhance your Mirage Dragon Jade. I will make a guide on how to enhance your Mirage Dragon Jade soon, so consider subscribing so you won't miss it. Now that is out of the way, let's start. The first source of gold lotus crowns is your main quest, specifically in chapters 16 and above. You can get 5 up to 10 gold lotus crowns every time you clear a mission in main quest chapter 16 and above. So make sure that you don't skip it, especially if it's your main character. The second source of gold lotus crown is by clearing 7 or more world daily tasks. You can get 3 gold lotus water after you clear 7 or more world daily tasks. Gold Lotus Water can be exchanged for a Gold Lotus Crown from the NPC Palace Attendant Jukwalyong in Red Lotus Palace Main Streets. Important Note. 1 Gold Lotus Water is equivalent to 1 Gold Lotus Crown. The third source of Gold Lotus Crown is from the Fish and Maze Clear Weekly Rewards. Starting at Labyrinth Level 5 you can get 5 Gold Lotus Water. The higher the Labyrinth difficulty, the higher the amount of Gold Lotus Water. You can get a maximum of 60 gold lotus water when you clear the fission maze at labyrinth 14 and above. You might ask that, I can't do fission maze at high labyrinth difficulty, what should I do? If you can't do a fission maze in high labyrinth difficulty then I recommend joining a fission maze clear service. To find fission maze service, press O, then type FM on the search bar and press search. I recommend finding fission maze service at labyrinth 13 because it is much cheaper than FM 14 service. Labyrinth 13 Fish and Maze service usually costs from 800 up to 1000 gold and it usually takes 5 minutes to clear. After clearing the Fish and Maze, the rewards will be available on Saturday at 9 am. To get the rewards, press the forward slash button, go to the Labyrinth Conquest tab, and click the Receive Reward button in the lower left of the window. The reward will automatically be sent in the mail. Important note. Gold Lotus Water can be exchanged for a Gold Lotus Crown from the NPC Palace Attendant Jukwalyong in Red Lotus Palace Main Streets. The fourth source of Gold Lotus Crown is by clearing the catastrophe of Red Lotus Palace World Daily Task. You will get three Gold Lotus Crowns after clearing the catastrophe of Red Lotus Palace. To enter, go and talk to Pathfinder Zephros in queue for a party for catastrophe of Red Lotus Palace. At the end of the run, you can get a certain amount of gold lotus crowns ranging from 4 up to 100 gold lotus crowns. The fifth source of gold lotus crown is from the party reward. You can get 10 gold lotus crowns when you filled up the party reward gauge to 100% by clearing a dungeon or nest in a party of 2 to 4 players, or clearing raid nest in a party of 5 to 8 players. Once you fill the party reward gauge to 100%, the reward will automatically be sent in the mail. The sixth source of Gold Lotus Crown is the Mission Bulletin Board Store. Go and talk to the Mission Bulletin Board Store NPC and click on the General tab. You can buy one Gold Lotus Crown for 10,000 Heroes Blood, Sweat, and Tears Point, or mainly known as BST Points. BST Point can be acquired when you clear missions from the Mission Bulletin Board. To see your missions, press L, and go to the Mission tab on the right side of the window. In there you will see the details and location of your current mission. The seventh source of Gold Lotus Crown is the Ladder Shop. You can buy 7 Gold Lotus Crowns up to 30 times every week on an account basis. The normal cost is 100 Ladder Points, but you can reduce it to 95 Ladder Points if you unlock the Ladder Shop Purchase Discount Combined Skill. To unlock this skill you will need 500 combined levels, so it requires at least 6 max level characters in your account. Important Note. Ladder points will be rewarded every Saturday at 9 a.m. based on the average ladder rating score of playing 10 matches in a week. You can also get 100 ladder points in World Daily Tasks by playing one ladder match every day. The eighth source of Gold Lotus Crown is the Guild Shop. You can buy one Gold Lotus Crown up to 20 times per week on a character basis. One Gold Lotus Crown can be bought using five Guild Honor Coins. Guild Honor Coins can be acquired from doing the Guild Delivery Missions. To see the guild mission details, press L, and go to the guild mission tab on the right side of the window, and in there you will see the details of each guild mission. The ninth source of gold lotus crown is the crystal point shop. You can buy one gold lotus crown for only 2000 crystal points. 
I put this source last in the list, because honestly, you can use your crystal points for better items like costumes or abundance talismans and etc. I will make a guide on how to enhance and evolve Mirage Dragon Jade to Parasline to Aurora Dragon Jade. So, make sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel so you won't miss it. If you have any questions, you can ask me in the comment section below. That's all for this guide. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next video. Oh,